What's up, Phase Zero BD here at San Diego Comic-Con, joined by Kobe Smolders, Maria Hill herself. Welcome back to Comic-Con. Thank you, welcome back yourself. Thank you, we got our first look at Secret Invasion just now. The footage yes. was amazing. It looks like a thrill ride. Really cool. Yeah. That was your first time seeing it? Yeah. Okay, tell me about where Maria Hill is at in that because it just looks like a really claustrophobic, don't trust anybody vibe. Yeah, um, it is that, 100%. I mean, when we think about the world that they're in, you know, the scrolls have been around since we saw them in Captain Marvel. They've been building in numbers. And, uh, you know, are they good? Are they bad? We're going to find out in the show. But there's certainly a lot of them. And so it sort of turns into this, can I trust you? Can I not trust you? And um, it's really cool. It's it, it certainly fraught with a lot of tension. Yeah, and the relationship between Maria and Nick Fury looks like it might be a little strained. Yeah, he's been gone. I've been holding, uh, Hell's been holding down the fort, you know what I mean? Yeah. So what's that reunion like? It's, it's, it's tentative. I think that Maria Hill thinks she can do anything. So All far she herself. can. So far she's doing okay. <laughs> she's handled a lot of, uh, she's, she's handled a lot yeah. for just a puny human, you know That's what I mean? Fair. She's, but I think she can see how broken this man is from loss and past experiences that she has a lot of concern about that. Now, you've been with this franchise for more than a decade now. Yeah, I think 39 years now. Yeah, yeah. so when you still, well, no, 30, I thought you said nine. I was like, wait, I'm not going to, I don't know. I did a it joke. Was a, yeah, I did a joke. Just, it's not 39. I'd, yeah. It's like 11 or 12. Yeah. I mean, congratulations. Thank you. It's really cool to see you getting like such a big role in Secret Invasion, and mm -hmm. you've been in so many films along the way. What has been the biggest surprise since Avengers rolled around and you got to explore this character in various titles with various people? And Yeah, I mean, they just keep asking me to play. <laughs> I keep like, I'll get like a call and they're like, we're thinking about you doing this. I mean, the Spider-Man thing was like such a lovely surprise and it's, that's a, a cool thing that they're doing uh, here at Marvel where the stories are kind of overlapping like they do in the comic books, you know? And being able to do a, a series like Secret Invasion is you're allowed you're allowing the audience to sit with these characters more in situations that aren't so, um, you know, so intense. We're able to see these characters, you know, chat around the water cooler. Like, what's that conversation like when you're sitting in a safe house, like, waiting for information about the bomb? You know, like, yeah. what, what, what is that like? Yeah. It's, it's much more human and you get to see a different side of these characters. So that's been exciting, exciting to explore. Back when Spider-Man Far From Home dropped, I'd love to know, did they tell you the scroll twist? Uh, no, they did not. It, that just kind of happened. No, I think they, <laughs> you know, they edited, edited it, edited it, edited it, edited it. They edited it together. And I'm not quite sure. Like, I think they just went like, how do they not know that this is happening? How they're so smart. I think that was it. it was like, Fury and Hill are so smart. Yeah. How do they not know this is coming? And maybe that was the solution. I don't know. But we certainly had conversations about that. But that was a surprise to me, yeah. I can't wait to see what you guys did with Secret Invasion. Yeah, Thank you so much for stopping really by. Great. I'm excited to Have see fun. you. Thanks for chatting. Thank you. Yeah, take care.